Two marijuana dispensaries recently applied for relocation in the town of Palisade. As we told you last week, Palisade trustees have approved the move of the happy camper. I have more on why the Colorado Weedery did not get the same authorization. Palisades Happy Camper Dispensary is celebrating its approval for relocating just off of Interstate 70 near Exit 42 at the north entrance of town. We are so excited. First of all, I want to thank the town because, you know, we had to come with a plan and an idea, and we did. And we tried to just do all the work necessary to make it happen, and they were so open to it, and we met all the expectations and all the requirements, and it was a, it was very humbling. This move follows issues with parking and traffic at the dispensary's current location on North River Road. Just one quarter mile from the Happy Camper's new plot of land is property the Colorado Weedery requested to buy. However, they were not approved. The Colorado Weedery's owner says the board's rationale for rejecting a conditional use permit is due to grape vines on the property, stating their removal would deteriorate the property's historic value. Palisades Development Director attributes the rejection to zoning issues. These sorts of uh, requests uh, is a conditional use permit and both uh, go through public hearings. And so ultimately, it's the decision of the, the Board of Trustees in regards to uh, whether that particular application or that particular um, proposal um, meets the criteria that are outlined not only in our code, but are also part of the, of the hearing. The Wine Country Inn has since closed on the property. Regardless of whether one or both dispensaries relocate, one thing remains true. The north entrance to Palisade will look different in the coming years. The Colorado Weedery says it plans to reapply.